Hello, Charlie here from Nansen. I wanted to film this guide quickly to show you the updated smart money that the Nansen team have just shipped. I think it's a real 10x improvement on what we had before, and I wanted to show you how you can get the most value out of it. So just as a quick reminder on smart money, uh, we have 350 million wallets labeled across a number of different chains. The most profitable 10,000 of them uh, represented by this little nerd emoji here, which you can be assigned for a number of different reasons. You might be a really profitable fund, or you might be a really profitable DEX trader, so on and so forth. Simply head over to the Smart Money tab, and one of the biggest improvements is that you'll see that Smart Money is now multi-chain. It also includes 500 Smart Money addresses on Solana, and personally, I think that the Solana uh, smart money is really, really actionable and has been printing very well in this recent Solana craze that we've been seeing. So in this example, I'm actually going to use Solana and you'll notice that we have three new tabs depending on what you're looking for. The leaderboard is a great way to discover addresses. Top tokens is a great way to discover tokens that smart money are accumulating in their wallets. And trades is a great way for you to discover what smart money addresses are trading in real time. Let's start off with the leaderboard, which is a PL leaderboard for the most profitable addresses uh, of that smart money category. You can break down the smart money label if you're just interested in tracking funds, for example. But uh, you have a lot of the common PL. Uh, columns that you've seen across Nansen before, like Realize PL, the ROI, the win rate, the trades, etc. You can change the date ranges and also you can change this to realized or unrealized gains. Uh, for me, I find unrealized gains really interesting because you can then track the addresses that are only going to become more profitable because they're eventually going to be cashing in their positions. And I find uh, like looking for some of those addresses which have a nice mix of realized and unrealized PL uh, can be a real home run. So the total PL will include the best of both. So that's also worth noting. You can really think about this as like a search engine for uh, smart money addresses in the way that you can get really granular on the data you want to see. Let's say I want to find addresses that have an 85% win rate. Maybe you want them to have made a minimum of five trades, but maybe no more than 100, because you might look to set alerts up on these addresses, and you don't want something in your telegram uh, like every minute, right? So we can reduce the noise there a bit, and maybe we can go realize PL $1 million, and we can see who we have here. We've got a number of addresses. Um, this guy with Tardio. He's got an 88% win rate. He's made nearly $5 million in PL in the last 90 days. I wish my uh, PL looked anything like this. But you'll also see there's a multiple meme coin whale address or label that you see when I'm hovering over this with Tardio.sol address. This is a label that I'm really liking at when finding addresses on Nansen. It means that they're a top uh, meme coin holder of at least two unique meme coins on Solana. And here we can see that this guy is active on Popcat and many of these other sort of blue chip asset or blue chip uh, meme coins that we see. So really great way to then do that initial discovery of addresses. You might then like to use the PL function in Profiler to understand a little bit more about where this address specifically is making his money. Next up, let's head to the top tokens tab. Uh, this looks maybe fairly familiar with uh, from the legacy smart money, except there are some improvements. This will now just focus on uh, DEX and SEX activity. So any outflows, inflows from SEXs and also decentralized exchanges. So gone are like a lot of the vesting contracts, uh, withdrawing from sort of staking pools and things like that. So the activity that you see in here is much more high alpha or shows a higher intent. You can take a look at the different sectors as well, depending on where you're playing in crypto at the moment. For me, I'm pretty active in meme coins and AI, so I can simply save that 
now it's going to show the tokens that fall into this category Mudang, Giga, Whiff, etc. Pretty interesting stuff there. You can also play around with a bit more with the filters if you just want to see tokens that have a certain market cap or have a certain token age because maybe you're just interested in tracking newly deployed tokens on Solana, for example. Last but not least, the trades tab. If you're looking to do a bit more sleuthing, you want to get in the, the weeds. This here looks uh, into the whole Solana uh, DEX space and will show you the buys and sells from the smart money addresses in real time. You can see this being updated to the minute here. Um, you'll see this even updating once we're going through this, but no longer are you having to wait for uh, any sort of data to, to refresh. It's all here presented directly to you. The way I like to use this is by applying a filter to try to find uh, or reduce the noise to signal ratio a bit more. I don't really care if they're only making a, a like $10 trade. Maybe I just wanna look at $5,000 value. And here I can see which addresses are buying or selling off their positions. So I personally like to use this to discover new opportunities. And we recently launched this little sprout emoji that you can see here, which signifies it's been a, a token that launched recently. So this low FTV, uh, super low FTV, two mil, uh, it's not quite sub one mil, but there you go. So depending on your risk appetite, you might look into these tokens differently, but they've all been bought by different smart money addresses. This guy, he's got a 94% win rate. He's made 250K over the last 90 days. Potentially that's something worth me exploring in token gold mode and beyond. Thank you for tuning in. I would love to hear your thoughts and feedback on these smart money improvements. And I look forward to winning on chain with you. Thanks.